make a little intro to prep you for the vlog that you're about to watch. It's a little bit of the night before, which is actually tonight, as well as hopefully some of what I get to do tomorrow during my first real day at a big girl job. So just a quick overview, I'm going to be going to work at Discovery Communications. Yes, if you've heard of Discovery, they are in charge of Discovery Channel, TLC, a bunch of food and home networks. Um, they are in charge of a lot of things. So I'm going to work there. I'm going to be a master control operator. So short and sweet the way I see it, I'm basically quality control for all of the content that goes out through all of their networks. So I'm really, really excited to be starting tomorrow. I'm pretty sure it starts with training and then I will very likely be having the night shift, which is 11 p.m. to 7.30 a.m., but I am super excited. So I hope you enjoy my night before and my day of footage. I started laying everything out. I don't know why. I like everything to be planned, well planned. I don't like to mess with the plan. So I have my outfit laying here. So we have outfit choices. I can't decide between my two new pants. So there are like two big days that I'm gonna have. I have tomorrow's my first day. And then I have, um, next week, I have like a new people, all the new people get together. So I'm pretty much just going to be wearing the same thing because I like it. But one day is going to be, what is it, one pair of pants that are like blue and patterned. The next time is just going to be these like maroony ones. Um, and they're really cute. It all works really well. And then I have these cute, you know, I'm just going to cut the tags off of everything right now. These are really cute. I got them at um, Payless, and I got them while they were on sale. So they were they were 40 but I got a pair for 50% off. So, you know, it all evens out. So they're really cute. They have, like, a little, like, brown bottom, and they have zippers on both sides, and then they're just black. And they look really cute with both of these pants because they're a little bit, um, like, straight leg, but they, like, kind of stop right by the ankle. So when you put these with them. I'll show it once I get it all on tomorrow, but I've got all these tags to take off. I'm not going to bother doing that. And then I have my little bag that I'm going to bring, you know, bring a cute bag, make some friends. And then I'm planning on bringing tomorrow in here. I just have like a notepad, so paper with a pen up top. My wallet has my license in it. An extra pen, a colored one, just because, you know, sometimes it's more fun if it's colored. Um, I have a tampon in there. I have gum and a chapstick. And then a pocket for my phone, because I don't really have pockets in the pants. And I think that's... And my lunch. My lunch is downstairs. So, I just put on and took off an entire face of makeup. I just wanted to practice. I don't know why. Tomorrow is just looking... It's just like so... I'm so anxious and nervous, but also excited. So I just did all of that. Um, I also tried one of these, what are they? NYX lingerie, um, the matte lip things. And I'm not really a fan because it is, it was sticky. So, um, oh well, not worth my purchase. I'm also trying to save the last few Oreos to pack in my lunch tomorrow, but I think I'm gonna pack my lunch actually pack it tomorrow because I Don't know I Stay having this problem where when I braid it even though I promise I braid it leg back I got this bubble And this side looks so nice and like you know contained and this one's just like a funky mess Alright, as always, I am running a little bit late, but not really. It's still 9.20 and I was going to leave in like 10 minutes. So I'm going to make a lunch. I knew I should have made it last night. I always go against my better judgment. So let's see what we're going to make. So, you know, blueberries. Ooh. That might be a lot, but whatever. I don't have any like, oh yes I do, have my Oreos, I have like, I think I saved like five or six left, 
only problem is, oh, just kidding. Since we got our kitchen redone, I still don't know where anything is. feature on this fridge all right y'all it is 9 30 on the dot and I'm heading out well packing up to head out but you know either way quite the accomplishment let's go just my luck I had to use the bathroom before I went to work like I literally had to poop so bad so here I am going really quick and we're off it's 9 46 but that's okay that's why you have a buffering, you know, time. <sighs> My GPS isn't working yet, though. So I had made it to the building, but I was like 30 minutes early, thank goodness. So I ran to a McDonald's to get food because I didn't have time to eat this morning. So uh, it's 1034, so I'm just going to get food and head back. Um, the little sign on the door said, um, what did it say? It was like, oh, you must like swipe your badge before getting in. And so now I'm all, <clears throat> what am I gonna do? So, wish me luck. I'm gonna get in. I mean, it's not, I have to get in somehow, but still. Okay. All right, y'all. I made it and I parked. And this is the kid I know from school, and I just happened to have parked next to him. So, here goes nothing! Okay, so today was about a three and a half hour day, not complaining. We basically just went through a bunch of um, slides. I think I showed it really quick in there a little bit ago. Um, just basic information. We took a little tour. I tried to like sneak some footage there. So we'll see how that came out. Tomorrow we're coming in and we get to just like shadow people in the pods. So like that's really exciting. Um, so yeah, good first day. We didn't even need lunch, so I'm like gonna eat my lunch on my drive home now. And my car is really hot. <laughs> but there's three of us, there's me, there's the kid who goes to school with me. His name is Jackson. And then actually I'm pretty sure this is the other guy's car. His name is Nelson. He's actually from Miami, so it was kind of funny. He was like asking us for all of our winter tips and like how are the winters here and stuff. So that was really cool. And he's like kind of older. He's been working since like 1997. He started as a master control operator and then he moved from Miami to here and he's got like a family and stuff. So that's kind of cool that we're going to have someone like experience. So like some questions he might be able to answer. Also turns out I'm going to be working um, for what's considered DLA, which is Discovery Latin America. So I'll be working with like not the US things so I don't know if I'll be listening to things in Spanish or Portuguese or I think those are my two options my two language options or if I'll have English with those subtitles or a mix of both they were telling me that there's a lot of options of those 
but that's really exciting and I'm really hungry so I'm gonna go eat my lunch while I drive home. Also, perfect so that I miss rush hour. Yay!